Kaitor, I saw people who were enjoying a nice day helping out the parks and rec department and going fishing. All the while, the effort was to send a message of inclusiveness. I think for me, the biggest takeaway is that our community here in Auburn, a lot of times people think small communities think one certain way. Um, but really, I think you see that Auburn is really open minded to lots of different things. Um, and I love the fact that our community is willing to support all people. Support all people. That was the message from Auburn's day of service. People painted buildings and put in new mulch at two different parks and went fishing at another. You got the biggest fish. You think? Me. How big was it? 13 and a half. All right. Was it fun today? Yeah. Originally, the plan was for about 20 to 30 people to volunteer. But today my favorite part was seeing over 77 people and that there were more, but we didn't get to talk to all the children involved that wanted to volunteer that wanted to help improve our parks and be a part of a great event that we were holding. In fact, so many people volunteered, they ran out of paintbrushes. And all the day of service showed one thing. Our community uh, isn't just a sign. Today's event was a partnership between the Auburn Parks and Rec Department, First Baptist Church in Auburn, and Wondercomer Company to do what they called a good deed and create a welcoming community. In Studio 15, Tony Sandleben, News Channel 15.